Heritage Party President Godfrey Mianda has successfully filed in his nomination for the 20 September presidential election. Brigadier General Mianda, who arrived at the Supreme Court grounds amid cheers from his supporters, had no problems organizing 200 supporters to back his candidature as opposed to two years ago when he had a tough time to file in his nominations. After General Mianda finished doing his formalities, Chief Justice Enes Sakara declared the former Republican Vice President as the duly nominated presidential candidate. I wish to inform you that in accordance with the Rule 7 of the Electoral Presidential Regulations, Statute Instrument Number 109 of 1991, I have determined that you have been validly nominated for the forthcoming presidential election. Later, General Mianda told journalists that he will scoop this year's polls and he will implement the village concept which has been propagating for the past decade. This election, according to you, the media, is already decided between two front runners, Patriot Front and MMD. So I accept that. But I am saying and addressing those who are not attached to those people, and I know from analysis, there are many, those who don't want to vote. If you believe in what I'm saying and the values that we've propounded over the years, this is the man to choose. And I believe that although people are talking that the real issues are constitutional changing, this and that, I am saying the real issue is to change the occupancy of state house. Many of the problems we have have nothing to do with laws because we have sufficient laws. This year's presidential elections will be the fourth that General Mianda will participate. In 2001, 2006 and 2008, the general ran for the presidency and he lost all the contests.